Those stormy conditions this morning derailed some of Harrison Harbor's plans for Christmas in July, but the festivities were a Christmas miracle for one local business that has been trying to open its doors for more than a year. 7 News reporter Chad Charette has more. It wasn't snow that halted Henderson Harbor's holiday celebration. A torrential downpour forced organizers to cancel its classic car show, along with the annual parade and band performance. We'll, we'll figure it out. Everything's fine. Christmas, you can't cancel Christmas. Despite the shakeup, folks still hit Henderson in droves, and the weather didn't have an effect on evening festivities, like the boat parade. This event has done what it's supposed to do. It brought people in, it brought people together. Waiting for the evening events to kick off, a lot of people took refuge in the historic Gill House. A pending sewer project has halted its opening on multiple occasions, but it's been given the go-ahead to temporarily operate during the weekend. Yeah, that's great. We're so happy you're here. We put a lot of work into this place over the last two and a half years, and after all of our work, it's like just so refreshing to open the place to the public. Owner Steve Vollmer says Tuesday he learned he could open and had to scramble to get things ready by Friday. One guest tells us she didn't even notice. So I expected bumps, but I really have to say I didn't experience any of them. The food was delicious. The staff was very friendly, accommodating. They knew the menu. With a successful weekend under his belt, Vollmer remains optimistic that it won't be long before this temporary opening becomes permanent. We're sitting here um, hoping we can kind of salvage the season and and uh, we'll be working in through the whole fall and early winter. The Gill House will continue serving customers through Sunday. Come Monday morning, however, it'll be closed until the sewer project is sorted out. Chad Charette, 7 News.